After becoming acutely sick with COVID-19 in April, Alicia Milano says she's still suffering with major symptoms, including chest pains and hair loss. In a video shared to social media Sunday, Milano, 47, ran a detangler brush over her head multiple times, holding up the sizable clumps of hair that came out. I just wanted to show you the amount of hair that's coming out of my head as a result of COVID, the actress and activist said, imploring her followers to please take this seriously and wear a damn mask. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention does not currently list hair loss as an official symptom of the novel coronavirus, though a recent study from Indiana University's School of Medicine found out of a sample of around 1,500 people experiencing long-term coronavirus effects, over 400 of them experienced hair loss. Milano revealed last week that she tested positive for the coronavirus antibodies after previously receiving three false negatives, despite experiencing basically every COVID symptom in late March. This was moving on April 2nd after being sick for two weeks. Milano captioned a photo of herself wearing an oxygen mask. I had never been this kind of sick. Everything hurt. Loss of smell. It felt like an elephant was sitting on my chest. I couldn't breathe. I couldn't keep food in me. I lost nine pounds in two weeks. I was confused, low-grade fever, and the headaches were horrible. Milano said her symptoms prompted her to take two COVID-19 swab tests at the end of March and both were negative. She also took a COVID antibody test, the finger prick test, that yielded the same result, negative. Despite her negative results, Milano said she suffered from lingering symptoms over the next four months, including vertigo, stomach abnormalities, irregular periods, heart palpitations, shortness of breath, zero short-term memory and general malaise, which led her to get tested again. She said she is donating plasma to help the fight against coronavirus pandemic and to possibly save a life. This illness is not a hoax. I thought I was dying. It felt like I was dying, she wrote. Please take care of yourselves. Please wash your hands and wear a mask and social distance. I don't want anyone to feel the way I felt. Be well. I love you all. Well, maybe not the trolls, just the kind people. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.